Neil, a dramatic 2-2 draw in your first game in charge. You must be absolutely delighted with the spirit of the team to come back like that. Yeah, b- before the game, I said to the guys, there's going to be moments of adversity um, and we're going to have to show some character and resolve and, and some, some what Cambridge United really stands for for me, some togetherness and, 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 and values that we believe in as, as a group. And, and I thought we did. And I thought the subs came on, made an impact. Um, first half, I thought we was outstanding. You know, we, we could have easily been three or four up at half time and deservedly. And I think if we'd been three up, we'd have been disappointed if we weren't four or five. Um, so to, I thought fair play to Charlton. They started the second half well um, and we didn't quite respond. But again, focusing on us more so, um, look, Gassan, two goals and, and, and the character to come from Brian and, and, and possibly could have won the game. Um, it's a big, big point for us. Yeah, it's a funny game really, wasn't it? Because as you said, after such a dominant first half where couldn't get the goal, you sort of knew that in the second half Charlton would come out strong and I guess they did what we didn't do and make the most of their time on top. Yeah, I, th- I think you, you come to the Valley, you come to Charlton, you, you know, we were that good first half, the fans were that frustrated. You know there's going to be a reaction at some stage. You expect the home team in any game of football, in any stadium, to have a 10, 15, 20 minute spell and you have to ride it. You know, learn about the players today. We didn't quite deal with that 20 minutes as well as I feel we should. Um, but I'd rather focus on the positive of how good we were for 45 minutes and then how good we were for the last 20 minutes as well. And ultimately, um, I know you got like two late goals. To, to people say we nicked a point we didn't we deserved a point in fact we probably deserved three yeah and it would have been easy for heads to drop you know with the recent run that we've been on to go two goals down but they did anything but that you know in the final 15-20 minutes or so but then I think we've got good players I think we've got a good group I think I've seen some really good performances in the games I've watched um, yes we, we know we have to fix the top end of the pitch um, and we've got players that I feel can score goals and we saw Gassan get on the score sheet twice today you know scored four goals last week you know the players have got the ability to do it it's getting them higher up the pitch and into the good positions um, and we also we have a transfer window as well to boost boost numbers it must fill you with encouragement in your first game to see that sort of performance you know away at a place like this look on the pitch yeah mega but the togetherness from off the pitch from the fans and the way they supported the team today that's that's as good as I've seen you know, as good as I've seen at any time um, here at the Valley um, they're stuck with the players they believe in the players um, the ovation the players got in they deserved it but the fans deserved it as well because that was the Cambridge United spirit that I know I grew up um, knowing um, as, a, as a teenager and that's what we want to see we want to see that uh, togetherness between terrace and pitch and you know that'll be on full force next week at home to Blackpool yeah I think what we've done today has shown what a good team we are and can be um, and the, the the belief in the camp uh, we've got now a week on the training pitch um, to try and implement ideas um, and, and, and next week yeah my first home game in charge then I want a, a big performance from the players